My name is Carolina Fogel, and I am the new East Coast Fellow for the Bon Appetit Management Company. About four years ago, I was sitting with a friend of mine having a conversation, and we started talking about sweatshops. And I'd heard about them before, but something about this conversation really clicked for me. You know, okay, I like to shop, but most of the clothing that I buy is almost certainly produced in a way that I don't agree with. So I kept thinking, you know, what about the desk in my room? That wood had to come from somewhere. What were the environmental impacts of that? How about the people that are making the desk? How are they being treated? What about my food? Something that I rely on every single day to sustain me. Where does it come from? How is it produced? What are the environmental impacts of producing that food? How are people being treated in the production process? So I started looking into this thing called Fair Trade and Fair Trade Certified. And my junior year of college, I actually had the opportunity to go to Oaxaca, Mexico, and live with Fair Trade Certified coffee producers. And while I was there, I saw a lot. I learned a lot. But one thing that really stuck with me was this understanding that those producers and I, all part of the same system, and it's a system in which truly the voices of those at the bottom of the chain have been taken away. And so when I buy from within that system, I'm actually contributing to that problem. So something like Fair Trade Certified is an attempt to try and address that problem, but there's still so much more that needs to be done. So this year, I have the opportunity to go to farms in the United States and really try and get a good understanding of farm practice from a social and an environmental perspective. So that at the very least, when I eat Bon Appetit food, I feel comfortable with the way it was produced. And I know on top of that, that Bon Appetit is working very hard to make sure it's produced even better. Because I'm going to be working really hard to make sure it's produced even better. So stay tuned. I think it's going to be a really good year.